Do you wanna know what weird things do Boston Terriers do? In this video, I'm gonna share with you what 140 other Boston parents said about weird things their Boston does. Coming up. Hey everybody, welcome to the Boston Terrier Society YouTube channel. I'm Donnie Gardner, the founder of bostonterriersociety.com. This is Bella, my Boston of over a decade, and I've been trying to get her ears to go up, but she only does it if I touch this treat. No treat. Treat. No treat. Treat. And I went ahead and surveyed the Boston Terrier Society community on Facebook. There I have over 20,000 people and I actually had 142 respond as the weird things their Bostons do. Now, this video definitely applies to other dog breeds as well. Okay, Bella wanted her treat, so I let her down. But basically I wanted to organize this video from something that's kind of common with all breeds to the most common thing within Boston Terriers. All right, coming in at number eight, Boston Terriers will make room in tight little spaces. Like if we're on the couch or even if we're on the floor, Bella will try to squeeze in as tight as she can, especially between me and my wife. And this was definitely the case whenever she was younger and other Boston Terrier parents report this. All right, coming in at number seven, sleeping under blankets. Now this was hard to put as far as like, where should I put this on one through eight? And I feel like sleeping under blankets is a very, you know, Boston Terrier style thing. Bella here, we actually got her a special bed where the blanket, there's a hood already on it. There's 10 times where Bella looks like she has literally lifted the blankets just to her head. It's pretty funny. All right, coming in at number six is farts. Yes, Boston Terriers too. And I think it has to do with their flat nose. They're just breathing in a lot more air, kind of like pugs with all that air comes more toots. And this was actually the second most common thing within that Facebook post. Testing sound quality. All right. Oh my goodness, Bella, that was terrible. That was amazing, Bella. Coming in at number five is licking. And this was number one on that list. But number five, basically Bella, whenever she was younger, she would literally lick wet spots on the couch. Like right here, we didn't have this couch obviously, but she would lick where there would just be a big old wet mark right on it. She grew out of that stage. Expect that if you have a brand new Boston Terrier puppy, they're gonna go through that licking stage. And a lot of dogs go through this type of licking, but know that it's gonna happen. Bella just ate a treat. That's why she's licking right now. Coming in at number four, they make their beds perfectly. Bella will move this little bed all over the house wherever she finds it comfortable. Like right now it's dark, but if the sun was out and there happened to be a sunspot somewhere else, she will move the bed right where she wants it. Coming in at number three, they snore. Once again, this is because they're flat nose and they happen to snore kind of like a 40 year old man. So if you're a light sleeper, get ready for the snores. Coming in at number two, weird sleeping angles. Bella's head looks like it's gonna fall off sometimes the way she has it leaning over the bed and a lot of other Boston Terrier parents report the same thing. Coming in at number one, and I think this is truly a Boston Terrier trait. Yes, there's other dog breeds that do this, but very, very specific to Boston Terriers and that is zoomies. What are you doing? Bella used to do this more often whenever she was younger. We used to call it her witching hour. Around nine o'clock, she would literally just go flying all around the house. She doesn't do that very much anymore. I, it's literally been years since this has happened. But for younger Boston Terriers, expect this to happen almost daily. Right now, she's just more interested in sleep. So if you got a brand new Boston Terrier puppy, you can expect all, if not most of these eight things to happen in your life probably within the next week. Now question of the day, what weird thing does your Boston Terrier do? Put it in the comments below and this could just be a running list. Now, if you wanna learn more about Boston Terriers, be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel just so you can get the latest from us and you can check out the videos that pop up at the end of this video. As always, until next time, life is better with a Boston. Right, Bella? Bella good? See, ears pop up when the treat comes out. Treat goes away, oh, now she needs it. All right, see you guys later. Some of you have been asking, how can you help support this channel? One even asked if I had a Patreon account that they could give to. I wanted to show you just two different ways you can help support this YouTube channel. Number one, you could either come to my store where I actually have stuff for sale. I hope you like some of those items. 
or the other thing that I just created, and I think this is gonna be pretty cool, if you click the little join tab that you saw right there, I have three different membership levels. At the very basic membership level, your name's gonna be added to the credits of each video after this video. So as long as you continue to give month after month, your name's gonna be added to the end of the credits for each video. So if you're looking to ways to help this channel, Bella and I truly appreciate it, and that's how you can do it. So thanks so much. <laughs>